Pancake, everybody. Our universe is truly enormous. Pulsars, planets, stars, black holes, and hundreds of other objects of impossible sizes that are in the universe. And today we've put together for you a collection of some of the largest objects in the space, including pulsars, galaxies, planets, stars, and more. We don't want to delay, so we'll start with perhaps the largest planet. Number 10. The largest planet until 2011. Tras 4b. The record-setting planet until recently was Tras 4b, located in the constellation Hercules. From 2006 to 2011, it was the largest planet in the universe. It is almost twice the size of Jupiter. What is curious, this planet is located in the binary system and there are no other similar ones yet known. In such systems, the gravitational forces of two stars interfere with the formation of planets and stable orbits. The planet Transfer B is a gas giant similar to Jupiter and is located very close to its star, only 2.8 million miles away. For a comparison, the distance from the Sun to Mercury is 36 million miles and to Earth 92 million. The planet completes a full orbit in just 3.5 days and this gas ball is very hot. Its temperature exceeds 1700 degrees. Hot gas tends to expand so this planet is porous. Its density is very low on average, as in styroform or balsa wood. That's very low. Although the Tresphora B is a large planet, but its mass is slightly less than that of Jupiter, so its gravity is less. This hot gas planet, with its large size and low gravity, is unable to hold its matter, so it is constantly losing it from its atmosphere. This gas plume drags behind the planet like a comet tail. This planet is a mystery to scientists. With such a gigantic size and disproportionately small mass, it simply should not exist. Yes, it is now losing mass, but how could it have formed under such conditions in the first place? Maybe once it wasn't as hot and therefore was smaller and more dense, like Jupiter. Then it was much farther away from the star in the past, where it was captured by a star somewhere along the way. Unfortunately, it is not possible to see this planet in person in the near future. The distance to it is unimaginably long, 1600 light years. This huge planet was discovered by the transit method back in 2006, and the results were published a year later. The program in which the research was conducted is called TRESS, Transatlantic Exoplanet Survey. It involves three small 59-inch telescopes from different observations equipped with Schmidt cameras and autodetectors. A total of five exoplanets have been discovered under this program, including Tras 4 b The new largest planet in the universe, HATP 32b. In 2011, a new largest planet in the universe was discovered, which turned out to be larger than Tras 4 b It is located in the constellation Andromeda, 1044 light years away. This planet exceeds Jupiter in radius by just over two times. That is, it is larger than Tras 4 b but its mass is about the same and slightly less than Jupiter's. Otherwise, HATP 32b is very similar to Tras 4b. This planet is also a hot gas ball, even hotter. Its temperature reaches 1888 degrees Celsius. This planet is also located close to the star, to be exact, at a distance of about 3 million miles, and because of its huge temperature, its gas is also expanding and losing. Therefore, its density is also low. Scientists are constantly discovering more and more new planets from other stars, and it is possible that this record will be broken, and soon we will learn about the other largest planets in the universe. And by the way, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like it and click on our intergalactic bell not to miss information about this planet. Now let's talk about the biggest star. By far, the larger star is UY, shield in the constellation Shield, about 9,500 light years away. This is one of the brightest stars. It is 340,000 times brighter than our Sun. Its diameter is 1.5 billion miles, 1,700 times larger than our luminary, with a weight only 30 times the mass of the Sun. It's a pity, it's constantly losing mass. It's also called the fastest burning star. 
star. Perhaps that's why some scientists consider the largest star to be the NML Swan. Largest Galaxy The mega monster among the galaxies known in our time is IC 1101. The distance to Earth is about 1 billion light years. Its diameter is about 6 million light years and contains about 100 trillion stars. For comparison, the diameter of the Milky Way is 100,000 light years. Compared with the Milky Way, IC 1101 is more than 50 times larger and 2000 times more massive. The largest black hole is not in the largest galaxy. Black holes are not measured in miles. The key indicator is their mass. The largest black hole is in the galaxy NGC 1277, which is not the largest. However, the hole has 17 billion solar masses, which is 17% of the galaxy's total mass. By comparison, the black hole of our Milky Way has a mass of 0.1% of the total mass of the galaxy. The largest Lehman Alpha blot. Let's start by figuring out what galactic blobs are. American astronomers have discovered two huge blobs glowing with gamma rays at the very center of the galaxy. These blobs cover most half of the observed sky from the constellation Virgo to the constellation Crane. They could be millions of years old. Hidden in a gamma ray nebula, the blobs occupy a space of 50,000 light years. American scientists believe that these are the remnants of the explosion of a huge black hole or a new star. The new discovery was made by the Fermi International Project Telescope, which was launched in the eighth year of the third millennium. The most sensitive gamma ray telescope in the world, every 180 minutes, seats the entire sky. So why have the blobs only have been detected now? Cloud of gamma rays were simply blocking them. Such clouds are detected by the interaction of cosmic particles and interstellar gas. A unique technique of American scientists allow them to see the invisible. The blots have clearly outlined boundaries. They look like the remnants of a brief energy ejection from a huge black hole, which is located in the center of our galaxy, the Milky Way. Scientists believe that these blobs are remnants of the most ancient matter from which all the stars of our galaxy were formed. Lehman Alpha are amorphous bodies, resembling the shape of amoebas or jellyfish, consisting of a huge concentration of hydrogen. These blobs are the initial and very short stage of the nucleation of a new galaxy. The largest of them, LAB1, is more than 200 million light years wide and is located in the constellation Aquarius. What else is interesting in the universe? Radio galaxies. A radio galaxy is a type of galaxy that has much more radio emission than other galaxies. Alcyonus is a giant radio galaxy in the constellation Lynx, located 3 billion light years away. It was discovered in 2022 using the Lofer instrument. The size of the radio galaxy reaches at least 16 million light years, making it the largest radio galaxy at the time of its discovery. The radio galaxy is named after Alcyonus, a giant from ancient Greek mythology. Did you know that even a void can have a size? Yes, we have the largest void on our list. Galaxies tend to be located in clusters that are gravitationally connected and expand with space and time. So what is in those places where there are no galaxy clusters? Nothing. The areas of the universe where there is only nothing are the void. The largest of these is the Volopes void. It is located in the vicinity of the constellation Volopes and is about 250 million light years in diameter. The distance to Earth is approximately 1 billion light years. Giant Cluster The largest supercluster of galaxies is the Shapley supercluster. Shapley is located in the constellation Centauri and looks like a bright seal in the distribution of galaxies. It is the largest array of objects bound together by gravity. Its length is 650 million light years. The largest group of quasars. A quasar is a bright, energetic galaxy. The largest group of quasars is the huge LQG. 
This structure consists of 73 quasars and has a diameter of 4 billion light years. However, the great GRB wall, which has a diameter of 10 billion light years, also claims the primacy. The number of quasars is unknown. The presence of such large groups of quasars in the universe is contrary to Einstein's cosmological principle, so their search for scientists is doubly interesting. In conclusion, we would like to talk about the largest object in the universe. If at the expense of other objects in the universe astronomers have disputes, in this case almost all have the same point of view. The largest object in the universe is the cosmic web. Infinite clusters of galaxies surrounded by black matter form knots and with the help of gases, threads that look very much like a three-dimensional web. Scientists believe that the cosmic web entangles the entire universe and connects all objects in space. The cosmic web is the largest object in the universe. All that to say so is like lying, because the largest object in the universe is the universe. Unfortunately, we can't even imagine this scale. All of us at school were told about the largest animal on Earth, namely the blue whale. Perhaps someone knows about the largest excavator, Belaz, but all this is something that can be measured. And measuring the universe is simply impossible. We can only dream that one day we will be able to travel through the universe at enormous speeds, covering distances in a matter of seconds. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like and comment. We wish you a pancake mood and see you all again.